hello guys welcome to my youtube channel so today i'm going to be trying to do a bit of a different kind of video which is a study with me video um so i am actually back home for the weekend um because my brother's 18th 18th birthday was yesterday and so i'm just going to be staying home um for the weekend for the mother's day weekend and so um i've i brought back with me some of my lecture notes and um yeah, i'm going to be doing a bit of studying hopefully i can be able to do a lot of studying and have a productive weekend here at home hopefully so today i just thought that i will show you guys a bit of how i go through my lecture notes um after a lecture how i take notes during a lecture and how i just go through notes and stuff so it's currently 6 p.m right now and there is like three no um three lectures that i want to go through at the moment hopefully this evening the first one is about like growth charts and like why we use them in money why, why we monitor like um why we do growth charts for children um the second one is about the principles of growth why growth is important why we need to monitor that and then the third one is about uh, menopause and why and just about menopause and the symptoms of menopause and how you treat them and stuff so these are the three um lectures that i'm going to be going through um, so what I do basically like some of you guys might know that I do print out the lecture slides um, before I go into a lecture and then when I go into a lecture as the lecturer is giving um, as the lecturer is speaking I write down like extra notes on each slide um, just go through if you look at my all my slides just like that I just write down extra notes and then what I do is like when I get home after the lecture I just go through the slides with the notes I had and if there's any extra notes that I want to add I can just add those extra notes on there so this is what I'm going to be going through this evening I'm just going to be going through um, the lecture notes and just going through the slides and just um, trying to understand the information and adding in any extra information so that's what I'm going to be going through uh, right now okay guys so i just finished um going through this lecture which is the principles of growth and then now i'm just going to be going through um growth charts and why they're useful so during this lecture the lecturer passed us on she gave us like these growth charts and um she made us plot some some um, figures on there just to make us understand um how um doctors monitor like growth charts and stuff and so um, down here you have like age in weeks and months and then on the side you have like the birth weight um, down here and then you have the head circumference up here and then you have the length right here so this is how they this is what they use to be able to monitor um, how well the child is growing um, and if they're to identify any problems that they can deal with and so I'm just going to go through um, that lecture right now okay guys so i just finished going through the lecture um, about growth charts and how to why we use them so now i'm just going to be going through the very last lecture it's about menopause the symptoms of menopause and how we treat them um so the thing about this one is i did not print out the lecture slides i decided to print out the notes that the lecturer uploaded herself so these are notes that the lecturer made herself and uploaded it um i decided to print them out um because i thought that because the lecturer made them they would have enough information that i need to know for the exam um but then the thing about this is that it's like 10 pages long so um i'm gonna need a bit of time to like go through this and highlight it and just like um write down any extra stuff so this is what i'm going to be doing now so guys i just wanted to show you really quickly the notes that i made for the menopause lecture during the lecture so these are the notes that i made during the lecture um i just write down like the slide number sometimes it sometimes it doesn't really match but when she changes the slide i change the number as well so it's just rough notes that i, I scribbled down really quickly um and then so now i'm just gonna go through the her notes and my notes and just like try and match things up and i'm gonna be using a lot of um colored pens and a lot of highlighting so that's what i'm gonna do now
production available in today's market. Upgrade your sounds today and start making hits. so guys it is finally 10 15 pm and i have finished going through um the notes hallelujah it was really long but um i really really enjoyed going through it, it didn't really feel overwhelming because i love how she structured her notes I, I like how she linked everything together how she was able to like link the symptoms and the signs and how she was able to explain it and how she was able to use like evidence from research papers to be able to explain like um, hormone replacement therapy about um, the risks and the benefits of it and yeah I just I don't know it's really really interesting so yeah I've just finished that so altogether that took me about four hours and 15 minutes exactly because I started at six and it's now 10 15 so it took me an hour each to do the two other lectures and it took me two hours and 15 minutes to do this one um so this is just like going through the information after the lectures and trying to understand this is not revision um over the easter holidays hopefully i'll be able to come back through these lectures and like do some revision and make flashcards and digest the information um try and cut it down a bit more so i can be able to remember so yeah um Hopefully this video was a bit interesting um, uh, just to show you guys how I go through my lecture notes after the lecture. Hopefully there will be um, more videos like this and um, yeah just let me know if you find this interesting and if you want me to do more. So thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely day and God bless. Bye. Bye.